Let's get right to it. The top skill for all data roles is SQL. Machine learning and data science roles are data roles. Why do I say that? Because machine learning models are built on top of data. And right now, most of that data comes from relational databases. Also, if you were to peruse the top job boards right now, you would see that 95% of all the roles in machine learning and faker science have SQL as one of their top required skills. Now, if you're new to IT and you don't know the data roles, they include the data analyst, the DBA, the SQL developer, the data engineer, every BI role. All right, you get the idea. If you're going to work with data in the real world, you must know SQL just the way it is. The question then becomes, what's the difference between the core data roles and the fringe roles like machine learning and faker science? From where you are right now, nothing. You need to learn and know everything a data analyst does. It's one of the reasons why the data analyst is such a great entry-level role. If you're new here, it's important you understand there are no entry-level roles in machine learning or faker science. None. You have no chance of attaining an entry-level role in either of these jobs without coming from an existing data role or a programming role. Okay, back to the questions on learning SQL. How do you learn it? Step one, you head over to LogicBot and you sign up. You then download the PDF, must know interview questions for SQL roles. You then print it out or open it up in edit mode if you have that software. Some of the answers are filled in. Some of them need to be filled in. Step two, you head to the course on the fundamentals of Transact SQL for machine learning engineers on LogicBot. Most of the questions on the interview study guide are going to be in that course. If they aren't, Google them. Step three, while you're filling in your interview worksheet, you should be taking notes. The course is dense. You need to know the information in the course. I don't mean watch it like you think you know it. I mean study it like a med student. If I met you walking down the street, I should be able to fire off any question from the interview study guide, and you should be able to fire back. If you can't do that, you don't know SQL well enough. Why do you need to know SQL so thoroughly? Because the technical interview is stressful, and those doing technical interviews will expect your knowledge of SQL to be well ingrained. If I ask you, what's a clustered index, and you stumble on that one, the interview is basically over. If you can't plow through the most fundamental SQL questions, you'll never work in a data role. Okay, once you've filled in the study guide and you've taken pages of notes from the SQL course, what do you do? Nothing. You go back over the course again and again until it sinks in. How long will that take? As long as it takes. The foundation for all data roles, including machine learning engineers and faker scientists, is SQL. You must know it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And of course, have a great day while you're studying SQL.